Hey folks, I am Joey Fomelli, one of the video producers here at Tested.com, and today I wanted to talk about a new piece of gear that I got. Uh, this is the Tilta Nucleus Nano Wireless Lens Control System. It is a wireless follow focus. Now, I've had a good relationship with Tilta. I've used her stuff in the past. You've probably seen some of the cages that I got for the GH5 or the Blackmagic. In just the past year or so, I've been reviewing some of their products that I've had an eye on. Uh, last year, I reviewed the Gravity G2X handheld gimbal. Now, ultimately, I decided not to buy that gimbal. Uh, not any fault of the gimbal itself, but just because I didn't have a way, uh, an affordable way to control the focus on those cameras that were on the gimbal. Now, you can use autofocus, but I can't always rely on that. I kind of need to have manual focus on those things for professional work. And I just couldn't find one that was lightweight enough to hold on a gimbal, plus be affordable. So basically, I decided to wait out on buying a gimbal. Now, that all might change because the Nano is exactly that. It is a, uh, at $230, it is a very affordable, lightweight, wireless follow focus system that's actually designed specifically for gimbals. I don't have that rigged up here. This here is my GH5 rigged up to um, a whole rail system with a V-mount battery. Like I said, I don't own a gimbal yet, but uh, even though these are built kind of for gimbals, they're not really exclusive to gimbals. You can, you can rig this up on your typical uh, cinema rig. The Nano comes with a small rail that can be set on a gimbal, but I can just set this up with my existing rail rig here by just sliding it on and tightening it up, locking the gear on the motor with the focus gear on my lens. And with this control here, I can essentially control my focus uh, from a distance of up to, uh, unobstructed, up to about 300 feet. Uh, on film sets I've been on in the past, they'll actually uh, create like custom laser cut plates that will hold the, um, the focus and uh, and a monitor together. So you basically have uh, a battery with a wireless video signal maybe, and then the wheel here uh, tapped onto the side, kind of locked in, and then you can, uh, a focus puller or a first AC can kind of have his own feed while pulling focus with this guy here. It's actually a pretty cool mobile setup when it comes to you know, indie film productions. Let's back up real quick. How does this thing actually work? It's pretty simple. This here is your control for the motor, and this here is the motor and the gears that uh, as you turn the control wheel, the motor turns and the gears turn the focus ring uh, for whatever lens you're using. You throw a 14500 battery into the control. Uh, this kit actually comes with two and a charger, and then you power the motor either through USB to your gimbal, or in my case, my battery plate on the back of my camera, or you can just power this through any USB bank. Once you power both these guys on, you match the channels by using the double click of the arrows, and then you calibrate the motor with the lens by holding down the calibrate button. The system will then run the motor to find the endpoints on each end of the lens. But if you want, there's also uh, like an A and B mode where you can actually set your own personal endpoints. So if you're doing a very specific move where you wanted to follow focus, uh, but didn't want the gears to run past a certain point, you can set those endpoints. And then as you keep turning the wheel, once the gear hits the A or B point, it'll stop. Uh, regardless of how much the wheels actually turn in there. And like I said, with a clean, unobstructed signal, you get about 300 feet with the wireless focus uh, system and about five to six hours per battery for the control. Um, when you start setting this up to a gimbal, it actually gives you some pretty cool options. If you're using the Tilta G2X, the control wheel will just kind of latch right on to the handle so you can run your gimbal and control your focus with your other hand. And the package here actually comes with hardware to help you mount this to other gimbals. Say if you have a DJI gimbal, the Crane 2, um, you can use these little attachments to help you rig that on. Plus, if you don't have real teethy focus rings on your lenses you can attach these slip gears on to give you control over your still lenses i'm bummed i don't have a gimbal here to show you this wireless system on that uh, it has been working pretty well on my little mini gh5 cinema rig here and i did get to try the gimbal set up at like the showroom floor of tilta but i don't have any video of that if i do end up buying a gimbal and i'll run some tests and we'll put it up on our tested instagram page where you can see uh, that thing at use so that is about it. It's a pretty straightforward little piece of gear at 230 bucks. It is insanely affordable for what it is. A wireless focus system at that price is almost unheard of in the production world. Um, all of these gimbals and sliders that are coming out for the consumer level are fantastic. But uh, what's really getting me excited are these peripherals that are coming out to help make that workflow a much more professional production. So that again is the Tilta. Nucleus Nano Wireless Control System Follow Focus made for handheld gimbals, or in my case, the GH5 Cinema Rig. Uh, links are below. Thank you guys for checking this video out, and until next time, stay focused.